about what will happen next year. So forget the group stages. They will be done. There will be a big league of 36 teams. The draw will be made in which you will play two teams from each of your side of the league. So the league's cut up into four, yeah? Four, four pots. Four different pots. Mm -hmm. Pot one being your big, big teams. Mm -hmm. Pot four being your rubbish teams. So everyone will play two from pot one, not the same team, different teams, mm -hmm. home and away, two from pot two, two from pot three, two from pot four. At the end of that, if you're in the top eight, if you've occurred enough points to put you in the top eight, you are thra straight through to the round of 16. So then you've got eight other teams, yes, that can make it. Mm -hmm. So you take that from the next part of the league, they play each other home and away, as we see now in the knockout stages, and they then book a place into the round of 16. If you're below 28, you're done. There's right. no dropping into the Europa League. You are out of European competition altogether. So, 25th or lower, you're done. If you're between 24 and 9th, then you play in this play another in system. Playoff. Play yeah, another playoff. Another exactly. playoff. Yeah. Two-leg playoff. Yeah. Uh, Naden, did I explain that clearly? Are you with it? Yeah, yeah, Dan. You did such a great job. Such a great job. You'll <laughs> unlikely have to ever... Describe that again. You did such a good job, Dan. But yeah, no, I, well I done, can explain Dan. it again. Well no problem. Nailed I'm all it. over it. Now I'm, we're yeah. good. Now we're good. We're I watched right. the video. It's all fine. Do you like this, Nadam? This new format? Um, it's different. It is different. I think it'll be interesting to see how we sort of like draw up the table of 36 and sort of have some of those permutations in mm. there, knowing that well, this team's going to go there, that team's going to go there, and so on and so forth. But I don't mind the idea of it being new i think football is something which essentially is quite conservative by nature but some new things make perfect sense and i'll be very interested to see how this goes and to see the difference in points between the team that finishes ninth and the one that finishes 24th and whether you feel you know by the time it's the mm -hmm. knockout rounds whether those teams should be competing against each other we given the fact the team in ninth might be a, a point away from eight but the one in 24th you know mm. they might be a million miles away from it uh, what they want as well. Well, they want extra games. We're going to get two extra games, more money, of course. And then you're going to get bigger yeah. games because you're going to see teams like Real Madrid facing two other opponents of that same level. So that's what they want to bring to the table. And also, they want every game to matter, which they feel in this format, this will be more effective, Mario. Yeah, I, I get that. But one of the key things, what I only have with this, because, you know, like, I knew this was coming because they've been building this for a long time. Um, the, the thing for me is, I, I just hope that if you add more teams to it, you're going to get more games. When you add more games, you, the guys are going to play more games, and then you get fatigued sometimes. I hope that the quality, that's the only thing. To have more games and more entertainment, of course. I'm, I'm, I'm an entertainer too. I love watching, you know, football. But one thing I don't want, I don't want to see players being outrun in the sense of like overrun, overplayed and everything. So the quality of the game drops. That's the only thing. But away from that, no. If they can handle more games and definitely you're going to have some teams. We cannot get away anymore with a with an okay team in, if you have 11 players. You need more than that because mm -hmm. if you want to compete in this and also at home in your own league... And then having them in the Champions League because everybody focuses on that because the budgets are great. They, they, uh, I've seen clubs, like when I came to Chelsea, for example, they couldn't even finish the training ground because they missed the Champions League for a couple of seasons. So not because they didn't have the finance, but because clubs are building themselves around it because they want to uh, activate the finance that they get from the Champions League and put that in work for maximize the potential of growing as a, as a club. So that's the only thing I want, the quality to stay on the field and making sure that we get entertained to the highest level. Do you want me to explain it again to you, Shane? No, no. Are you on it? Are you sure? I, I, Do you like it? Uh, my, my most immediate concern, and which Mario touched on, is that you're adding games to a calendar yeah. that is, is already packed as, as is. And, and also, of course, as I mentioned, the idea is that every game matters, so you can't necessarily rest players for the fifth and sixth it's, round. I, you know, I, I, and that for me is, is well... The primary, my primary concern around how, how packed the calendar already is mm. and, and all, all kinds of suggestions about adding more international games and, 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 and of all descriptions. So that, for me, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not awfully uh, thrilled about. I, other than that, I'll, I'll have to wait to see how the competition kind of pans out. And while I listen, I, I understand, yes, top teams will be playing each other or there's a possibility of them playing each other earlier in the competition. Um, I... I, I need to see how, how that kind of 
will show later on in, later on in, in, in the Champions League in, in terms of in terms of the excitement and in terms of, 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 of what's to come. My, my only other, other concern is in listening to, to UEFA's announcement, quite clearly they have the Super League in, in their sights. Um, straight away they, they talk about, mm. well, th this is an open league that you qualify for from sports. That is a direct attack at, 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 at the European Super League. Now, my, again, my concern is, do you craft this competition just because of the Super League? Not because you think it's better, not because you think it's, it's, it's going to improve on, on the current format, but because the Super League was, was such a threat um, a, a, a couple of years ago that you feel that you had to do something. I, I, I don't. I will never buy into let's just do something because. I don't worry about the Champions League. That would be a great tournament. I'm sure it will be. I, but I worry for domestic football. You know, when you're talking about resting players and Mario was talking about players being overplayed, where do you stop them playing? Where do you play your second string sides? You're going to, in England, you're going to stop them playing in the FA Cup, which has had a bit of a resurgence this year. You're going to stop them playing in the Carabao Cup. You know, all those sort of things. And in the league games where you think you can go and win, you won't play your full teams. And that's a worry for the domestic game all around Europe, I would say. I don't like it. What's the point? Yep. Changing it. There we are. Bring it again to me, yeah? Well, I don't want to now. In protest of it against <laughs> it, you've got your one explanation, and that is it. Uh, meanwhile, there is Champions League action coming up in a big game, of course, at the Allianz Arena. Uh, Bayern taking on Lazio. 1-0 down going into this tie. 